Babies are born with a set of reflexes critical for survival in the outside world. Some of these reflexes are so obvious you might not think to look for them, such as the breathing reflex or the eye blink reflex. Rooting is one of the most critical reflexes. By touching four-week-old Lily's cheek, she'll turn her head and open her mouth in preparation for nursing. Once the baby is in contact with a breast, a bottle, or even a finger, the sucking reflex takes over. Involuntary at first, the neonate will gradually gain control over sucking during the first year. Placing liquid in the mouth will induce the swallowing reflex. In the first few weeks of life, it takes all the baby's concentration just to control these various uncoordinated reflexes. At this age, feeding Julia can take over an hour. After about six weeks, though, Julia will be a pro. There are other reflexes babies are born with that we don't completely understand. In the first two months, babies exhibit the stepping reflex. This is probably a precursor to walking. Watch Lily's toes fan out and curl. This is the Babinski reflex, which occurs when the bottom of a baby's foot is stroked. You can also do like a toes curling. When pressure is placed on the baby's hand, you can see the grasping reflex at work. Lily's grasp is strong enough to support almost her entire body weight for a few seconds at least. When startled or dropped, a baby may respond with the Moro reflex. The arms fling outward and inward as if the baby were groping for support. Two-month-old Julia doesn't even need to be awake to demonstrate this reflex.